let us look at a few examples of uh, area of circle now this is a circle with radius of 5.6 centimeters you want to find the circumference and the area so let us first write the circumference the formula for circumference and write c for circumference it is 2 pi r or pi times diameter okay and the formula for area is well known pi times r squared so we know r we want to find circumference so it is this is 2 times pi times 5.6 so this is nothing but uh, this is let us use a calculator so 2 times uh, 5 is 10 and uh, this is 11.2 am I right so this is 11.2 pi okay or 11.2 pi centimeter so let us use a calculator so where's my calculator so this is my calculator and uh, menu run so let us let me do two times pi times 5.6 so two times shift pi times 5.6 which is 35.2 we'll write round this in one decimal point 35.2 centimeters or uh, was i right 11.2 times pi is yeah the same thing so 35.2 centimeters in 1d 35.2 was I right 35.2 yeah 35.2 centimeters and this is rounded to one decimal point so area is pi times r squared which is pi times 5.6 squared so using again the calculator so shift pi times 5.6 squared which is 98.5 centimeter squared 98.5 keep forgetting the answer 98.5 centimeter squared the unit of area units are very important whenever you do any example of measurement make sure that you write the correct unit so if you don't write the correct unit you will lose marks okay the next question is yeah this is, you've got a circumference you have to find the radius and then the area so yeah what they've given is c is equal to 2123.2 centimeters therefore i can say 2 times pi times r is 123.2 i want to find r so what should i do i want to get rid of this 2 and okay uh, i want to get rid of this 2 and pi so i'm going to divide this side by 2 times pi so divide this side also by 2 times pi which implies r is equal to what happens to 2 2 gets cancelled and pi gets cancelled so what remains on the left hand side is only r so your r is 123.2 divided by 2 pi okay so let's use a calculator so this is 123.2 divided by i'll put this in the bracket 2 calculator can understand 2 pi this is 2 times pi so it's 19.6 centimeter in one centi in one uh, decimal point 19.6 centimeter in 1 dp and now once we have found area r we can find area area is pi r squared which is pi times 19.6 squared okay so this is uh, as you're using calculator let us use this whole number so let me use like this so shift pi times shift answer squared so the problem with this if you keep rounding uh, this is all right this is the final answer but if the answer is area you round it two times uh, the answer can be slightly be different so let us not round at this stage because area 
is the next stage. So this is 1207, 1207.8 centimeter squared, 1207.8 centimeter squared, again in one decimal point. Okay, let us look at the last question. Divide the area, you have to find the radius and the circumference. So, area is equal to pi times r squared is equal to 301.84. So, I want to get rid of this uh, pi. So, I'm going to divide this side by pi. So divide this side by pi. Therefore, I can write r squared is... 301.84 divided by pi. So let me use calculator. 301.84 divided by pi. So just and so let me and then if you want to find r, you have to find the square root of this number. So I'll do shift square root shift answer. So calculator has taken 96. Point this whole thing as the square root. So we'll have the final answer is radius is 9.8 centimeters. So I would say r is equal to square root of 301.84 divided by pi. So let me remove this r squared. So r was 9.8 centimeters 9.8 centimeters so from this we can find the circumference circumference is 2 times pi times r which is 2 times pi times 9.8 so this is 2 times pi times 9.8 is 61.6 centimeters 61.6 centimeters again in one dp this is also in one dp or decimal point